Here in Utah, there are tons of things to do outdoors in the winter, and one of the most exciting is snowmobiling. So right now I'm at Daniel Summit Lodge, halfway between Heber City and Duchesne, and they're gonna get me outfitted in all the right snowmobiling gear. So come on, let's go hit the trails and have some fun in the snow. All right, you ready to get suited up? Uh-huh. All right, we got these coats over here, get new ones every year. We got the pads in them, waterproof, help you keep warm out there. You think I'm a large? Are you trying to tell me something? I'm not trying to. I'm not trying to be mean. These coaches just run really, really, really small for some reason. <laughs> Whatever you say. <laughs> Shoot, that's heavy. <laughs> it actually looks a little bit too big. Let's get you a smaller one. Why is it a good idea to have specific snowmobiling gear rather than just wearing whatever you walk in with? The biggest thing is, um, if you wear your own gear, um, you come back smelling like exhaust. So if you wear our stuff, they already smell like exhaust, so you're not going to ruin your own clothes or rip them or anything. And it's probably really warm too, right? Yes, it is. Right. These are very warm. Do I put this on over my shoes? Yeah, is that you big can. Enough? Yeah. Okay. They unzip all the way up to your hips, so it's real easy to put your feet through there. Is it's this the right great. size? Yeah, just okay. put those straps up a little bit more. Yeah, what we're going to be doing, we're going to get up on a 10,000 foot ridge. We're going to head up. Um, it's called Strawberry Ridge. You look down into Hobble Creek. From up on Strawberry Ridge, you can see Springville. Then on the other side of the ridge, you can see Strawberry Reservoir. We're at 8,000 feet right now. We get up to 10,000 feet. You'll see the views up there. It's actually really amazing. So it should be fun. It's going to be a lot of fun. <laughs> there you go. Now you look like a ninja. Ready to go kick some trail butt out there. All right, you ready to go? Um, I think so. You think so? <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> we'll see about that. All right, you good to go? I don't know, yeah, I think so. Like a little kid at Christmas. I love that. <laughs> <laughs> I think you might need a little more experience on a snowmobile before I try that, right? That's true. Can we make some snow angels? <laughs> okay, hold on. Bring it up. Oh, pretty. Yeah, let's go. Let's get going. Strawberry Ridge right here. And we're at 10,000 feet? 10,000 feet right here. Wow, that's pretty cool. Basically at the top of a mountain. Yeah. Plan. Yep. <laughs> so what are we looking at over there? Down there, that Strawberry Reservoir. Really good ice fishing in the winter. Awesome trout fishing in the summer. All right, all this right over here, this is called Hobble Creek. Um, right between those two mountains right there, you really can't see because of the fog, but you're looking right down into Springville from up here. Awesome country though, real good snowmobiling. Four wheeling. There's a that's just a mess of four-wheeler trails, Jeep trails, and motorcycle trails. You could spend a weekend out there and never run over the same trails twice if you wanted to. The cool thing about this is that you're coming over every little bend and you just get this giant vista of the most beautiful landscape I've ever seen. But you can come up here with your own snowmobile, right? Yeah, you can. And yeah. you don't have to rent them like we did. And you can come up here and just play around all winter long. Mm -hmm. It's gorgeous. All right, let's get going. Head back to the lodge. All right.
What's great about this is that you can be a beginner and you can be an absolutely proficient snowmobiler and, and have fun here, right? Yeah, exactly. We had a great time today at Daniel Summit Lodge. Thank you so much, Josh. All right, thanks for See coming See you later. Out. See ya.